Continuing on with our look at matrices, let's see how we can perform arithmetic operations. There are two types of arithmetic operations in MATLAB, matrix operations and array operations. Matrix operations basically follow the rules of linear algebra, while array operations are performed element by element. These rules affect the multiplication, division, and power operators. For matrix operations, the operators are the asterisk, backslash, and caret, just as we've seen previously. However, for array operations, these operators are dot asterisk, dot backslash, and dot caret. Basically, array operators have a dot in front of them. Let's see how a matrix versus an array operation differs. We will use multiplication as an example. We'll start with the matrix multiplication of the two matrices shown on the screen. In matrix multiplication, each element of the resulting matrix is the dot product of the two matrices. So for the first element, this would be 10 times 8 plus 3 times 15. You would do this for every element and end up with a matrix with the values of 125, 53, 244. For array multiplication, the operation is simply carried out element by element. So for example, let's take the first element again. This would simply be 10 times 8. Second element would be 3 times 5, and so on. Final result would be 18, 15, 120, and 12. Notice that this is very different from what we ended up with using matrix multiplication. For this course, we will mostly be using array operations, so don't worry about learning matrix operations. Important thing to remember here is that array operations start with a period, so it is dot asterisk, dot backslash, and dot caret. Let's see how these operations work in MATLAB. Let's start by defining the matrix A equals 10, 3, semicolon, 8, 12. And B equals 8, 5, semicolon, 15, 1. Now to perform an array multiplication on these matrices, we simply type in A dot star B. Now one thing to note is that the size of the matrices must match. In our example, A and B are both 2x2 two two matrices. However, let's say we now change matrix B into a 3x3 three three matrix. Notice that in this case, trying to perform the matrix multiplication results in an error. One other thing, you might be wondering what happens if we want to perform an operation with a matrix and a scalar number. So for example, if we try to multiply A by 2, in this case, it doesn't matter. You can either use the asterisk or the dot asterisk operator, and they will give the same result. You might be wondering about addition and subtraction. Well, the matrix definition of addition and subtraction is exactly the same as the array definition. You simply add the numbers of each matrix with each other. In this case, there is no dot plus or dot minus operator. If we switch back to MATLAB, and let me remake the matrix B so that now A and B are the same size. Now if we try to run A dot plus B, you'll see that MATLAB throws an error. But of course you can always use A plus B. 